Hello, uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it is July 12th of 2019. I uh, wanted to tell you about Walmart Grocery. Um, let me though fill you in a little bit on background here. If you've been following my YouTube videos and my blogs for years or whatever, you probably know. But let me, for those of you who may have just found the video or something. Uh, like I said, we're in Fort Worth, uh, Texas. <clears throat> I'm uh, 78 years old. Uh, we do not have a car. My ex-wife and myself and my grown son, <clears throat> we live in this apartment and we share the expenses. And uh, my ex-wife is confined to a wheelchair. Um, next door to us, we have a grown daughter and her son, a grown son, and they live in that apartment. She does have a car. So she has taken me to doctor's appointments, things like that. But, uh, for the most part, <clears throat> my ex-wife, and in fact, because she likes to do it in a way, uh, they have been growing uh, by a service that picks up handicapped people. And they have been going once or twice a month to Walmart and buying a lot of groceries, which are loaded onto this bus type of vehicle. It's not a bus, you know, like a, not like a city bus, but it's a, you know. <laughs> and so <clears throat> they pick up people and drop them you know off within the Fort Worth area and uh, so they would go to the, and they would pick they would get lots of stuff they were allowed you're allowed to do that so, <laughs> so that thing would come back I would arrange to you know to meet to go out there to help them unload the stuff and at that time uh, I drank a lot of coke as you know Coke Zero, and uh, there'd be, I don't know how many, two-liter bottles of Coke Zero rolling around on this bus floor, uh, and then, of course, drinks for them, and uh, so it was kind of, a, kind of a problem, but um, so then... Uh, Amazon groceries was offered and we started ordering from them. So my ex-wife and my son would still maybe once a month, maybe, you know, go once a month to Walmart because the prices are good. And uh, we started ordering in from Amazon, but we couldn't get everything from Amazon groceries. Maybe that's changed. But... Uh, and, of course, it was delivered, you know, uh, locally. But uh, my ex-wife, of course, is very familiar with all of the Walmart products, the great value brand or whatever. Uh, some of it is fine, and then some I don't like, uh, really. Of course, she'll get whatever I, you know, if I say I want such and such, she'll get it. But still, she likes the inexpensive brand, not always the best. Excuse me, I just had a hot dog, actually a sausage. So, uh, so we were ordering it from Amazon. Then we heard that uh, Walmart was... Well, first doing that you can pick up there. So we we tried that. It was okay. We had uh, did an order to Walmart, and then my I rode. I, th I think we only did it once. I rode with my grown daughter over, and we they you don't have to go in the store. You just pull into this area. They have signs up. And uh, they um, uh, 
you know, you tell them who you are, and then they bring it out and load it into your car for you. It was okay. Um, that was kind of a spicy sausage that I had. Um, then we uh, we heard that Walmart had uh, home delivery for the groceries. So um, we logged in. We couldn't find how to. Uh, we're all pretty much. We all have our own computer, and we're all pretty much. Every one of us is uh, pretty computer literate. Couldn't figure out how to do it. The ex-wife called finally, Walmart store. They said, "No, we don't. Uh, we don't deliver food." Uh, and then I said, "Well." try a different store. So she tried a different store and got switched around. And then somebody said, yeah, uh, but you have to call DoorDash, which is, a, I think that's it, name of it. And it's going to vary with whatever area you're in. That's going to be the thing, see. Uh, Walmart may not have in your area, here in the Dallas-Fort Worth area and other all across the United States, but depending on where you live, maybe they don't make, perhaps they do pick up only at this point, or perhaps they do pick up and delivery. So, um, anyway, so how do we, con what do we call up this food, you know, their DoorDash or whatever is like a uh, Uber and a Lyft, private individuals using their vehicle, and they sign up with, if DoorDash or what, whatever the name of it is. Because I had a guy the other day who delivered the Walmart uh, stuff, and he said, this is the first time I've delivered groceries. I don't know what. And I said, yeah, you know, Walmart is using your company uh, service or whatever. So I didn't know that. So, so then finally we figured out where you log into Walmart and... Uh, ordered and it worked out great you know they have that <laughs> you go online you check what you want the prices are great you can if you want to you can check and say make a substitute or whatever a couple of times they've done that and it worked out to our advantage i think they were out of toilet paper or something and they gave a larger amount at the same you know the and it was something else like that i think well, I think the last time the ex-wife wasn't too happy because she ordered a mixed box of donuts and we got uh, at the same price or whatever it was, maybe it was a little less, a box that was all one kind of donut, glazed donuts or something. So she would have liked it. <clears throat> but we've been happy with the service. Everything's been, and you, if you have a problem, you just tell them. I don't think we've had a problem. I mean, like if you product wasn't good or whatever they take care of it so so uh now with the link that you see i guess down below if you log in to that and when you log in using the link that you see below i guess you'll get get a screen like this this is what I get it looks like it's uh, pickup but it's pickup or delivery if they offer delivery in your area so um, you enter your email address or whatever your you know you have to have an account with them so I'm guessing you have an account with Walmart well maybe you don't well you have to set up anyway you log in with your email account and if you order uh, if you spend $50 or more before taxes, uh, you will give, uh, you'll be given a discount on your first order of $10. And I will get a, a code that the next time that we order groceries from Walmart, I can enter that code and I'll get ten dollars off. So please, uh, please do that. Um, the reason is um, 
you know, I've been with uh, YouTube since they began. I was doing streaming video before there was a YouTube or a Amazon or a <clears throat> whatever. But you can see here for the last 28 days, uh, the revenue that uh, they only pay you when you, they pay once a month and you have to have a commissions that amount to more than a hundred dollars here you can see for you know the last 28 days i have a commission earned of twenty dollars and 41 cents um so of course this isn't going to replace if you use this walmart thing because uh it's not like i'm going to get ten dollars a day or ten dollars you know we we won't want to get our ten dollar discount when we order we order like twice a month maybe from uh, Walmart groceries. So, but anyway, it's I think it's still nice. So please use this link if you if you can and get ten dollar discount for yourself the first time. And I say we'll get ten dollars, but on the other hand, I think you have to use it within a certain amount of time. I'm guessing. And also, I think there's something where you, you know, if, you know, we can only get so much, you know. But anyway, give it a try. Also, if you watch my videos, you'll see, let's see, this is not it. Let me close this. Um, you'll see that I have links to Amazon products if I talk about something. I put the link below. To, like if I talk about maybe my uh, Panasonic G7 camera. Um, you know, there would be a link to it. Or if I talk about something, I a lot of times put links to things. And so I've been with, uh, have it, I've been an Amazon associate for, whoops, okay, forever. I've been. I guess before Amazon, well, when they came, you know, maybe not right away. Maybe I didn't. Uh, but here's what I've been paid monthly. Let's see how far it goes back here that they show it. Okay. It goes back to uh, February of 2009. Here on the right, you can see how much. And remember, they only pay... Amazon only pays when it's uh, ten dollars or more. Uh, oh wow! There's a month I I, I actually got thirty four dollars. Uh, oh, forty two dollars. But you can see basically. Uh, so, you know, for me, Amazon, you know, you have to, it has to be more than $10 before they pay you. And, uh, so if you, if you can, please use the, um, there we are. Please use the Amazon links that you see there yeah, because you don't have to buy that product. If, you know, if I show you the, uh, this Panasonic G7 and there's a link to it, or if, if I tell you that I'm using this product for uh, my Placostomus to uh, feed them or whatever with the fish tank or whatever, if you, uh, now, especially, you know, you don't have to buy the product. If you go there with that link, and then you're then you're at Amazon, and then you decide, okay, let's buy that big screen TV or let's buy that uh, new computer system or whatever, I will get a commission, not a big commission, but I'll get a commission. So yeah, sure, go there for the little items, but especially use that link, go there, and uh, if you're deciding to. Uh, purchase some big items. There was a law enforcement agency that I helped 
and uh, they were buying a bunch of digital cameras and other stuff. And I said, hey, <laughs> they were buying them from Amazon too, you know. I said, hey, use my, they didn't, you know. Would have been kind of nice, but they didn't. I know it's, we don't use, you know, all of us have just been conditioned not to, uh, not to use links, not to, I had uh, on my blog, Whenever, let's see, when, when did Apple come out with, everybody was waiting for the iPhone. Apple did not have a, you know, a phone. And everybody was waiting, news media, everybody was talking about people lined up around, you know, the Apple store for I don't know how long, a week or whatever, in order to get the new iPhone. And I was, I don't think I talked about it on YouTube. I'm not sure YouTube existed then. But on my blog, I was telling people, hey, this website, you have an excellent chance you can get, you can win an iPhone. Your chances are 1 in 10 at you know, the next day or whatever. Hey, you need to go here. That Your chances are like 1 in 15. You know, they're giving away one iPhone, and all you have to do is go to their website and write a couple lines in the comment section about why why you like their site or something like that. And anyway, I kept telling people, uh, I don't think hardly anybody went. You know, they hardly anybody went. Uh, who do you think won the iPhone? I did. <laughs> and that's happened in the happened because I've been blogging since 1982 or whatever. That's happened in the past on other things. I would tell people, hey, and people just were all conditioned that, okay, it's a, it's a, a ripoff, it's a gimmick, it's a scam, it's whatever. And uh, actually, I didn't get an iPhone because they couldn't get one, and they kept trying to get one because everybody was trying to get them. So they finally contacted me and they said, uh, Jim, would you take money? And I said, sure. So they gave me money. So anyway, what else do I need to tell you about this um, Walmart grocery thing? I think I've covered, I think I've covered everything. The only thing I want to explain to you again, people say I repeat myself. Okay, that's, yeah, I do. I repeat myself. Because for some of you, it, you know, it needs to be repeated. Uh, in your area, depending on where you live, this thing may not be, Walmart may not be delivering in your area. I'm sure they're covering as much of the United States and all the populated areas and whatever. But you may live in some place, I don't know, like Raymore, Missouri or uh, Peculiar, Missouri or someplace or well, maybe it's a service I don't know if it's available there or not but you may live in some place like that and not be available but if it is available in your area and if you want to take advantage of it or try it here's where you can get ten dollars off your first order and uh, next time maybe we order one thing too I wanted to mention to you that give you a little perspective on this like I told you once, maybe it used to be like once a month, maybe my ex-wife and grown son, they would go to Walmart. Maybe, I think you and they would get a lot. We, we eat a lot of stuff. So, uh, and get a lot of stuff. But then once, probably once a month, probably, you know, for sure, we would order Chinese food, spend about $40. Uh, and then after we started doing this, I ordered Chinese food, or my son, I can't, you know, sometimes he orders, but I ordered Chinese food, you know, it was about $40, and I thought, you know, I'm not going to order Chinese food anymore, I, for just a slight, for a little bit more than that, uh, Walmart will deliver, I, I can just go online, and, uh, because you pick the time, you pick the day too, but you can pick the time, you know, they'll like you, 
get the order in. We get uh, my ex-wife actually. She loves. I don't think I've actually ever ordered. She loves to pick the the you know the products and the and the prices are really good. So, but anyway, I I was just like um, usually once or twice a month, at least once a month, we order Chinese food. And now I'm th I'm thinking, you know, for a little bit more than 40 bucks, we could just log on and they'll, that day, you know, uh, it'll be delivered to our door. With the frozen goods and stuff, they uh, have ice packs in there. So, uh, anyway, please use the link and I thank you very much.